Fulton Lee says a 17-year-old boy has been charged with the murder of 15-year-old Eliane Andam, who was stabbed to death in Croydon in South London. Well, let's cross there live now. Our correspondent, Ivor Bennett, is standing by for us in Croydon. So, Ivor, tell us more. Yeah, we've just had this update from the Met in the last 20 minutes or so. They say that this 17-year-old boy who was arrested uh, on suspicion of Eliane Andam's murder two days ago, well, he's just been charged with her murder. He's been charged with murder and possession of a knife, and he's due to appear in court, youth court, sitting at Croydon Magistrates Court later on uh, today. This follows an extensive investigation in the last two days. Um, detectives have looked at CCTV, they've spoken to witnesses, they've gathered, gathered evidence from the scene here, and they added in their statement that uh, yesterday they recovered a knife in Cedar Road in Croydon, which is around half a mile uh, away from here. So this 17-year-old boy, uh, who cannot be named for legal reasons, he's been charged with the murder of this 15-year-old schoolgirl, Eliane Andam. She was uh, stabbed to death as she stepped off the bus here on her way to school around 8.30 on Wednesday morning, almost exactly 48 hours ago. And in those last 48 hours, uh, flowers, a lot of flowers have been left on this spot, which really um, hit ho hits home to you, the impact her death has had on the community. And yesterday, a vigil was held here, yesterday evening, in her memory, lots of her friends and family uh, turned up to pay tribute to her in what was clearly a very uh, emotional and painful uh, experience for them. Uh, a statement was read uh, on behalf of the family by the Bishop of Croydon in uh, which uh, they described Eliane as a beautiful person inside and out and they said that they are overwhelmed with sorrow and grief at her death. She was just 15 years old. She had just entered her GCSE year. Uh, when she was stabbed to death on her way to school. And as I say, police in the last few moments have now said they've charged a 17-year-old boy with her murder. He cannot be named for legal reasons. And he will be appearing in court later on today. Ivor, thanks very much indeed.